fact, uh, it has been a very good experience. I knew MTV uh, Himalaya from long time. Uh, I was always following the event, and um, I never thought I would have the chance to come here. Uh, to be totally honest with you, Le and last year uh, it happened, <laughs> and I couldn't believe it. <laughs> and uh, here I am again because. Being in this race was something that I really wanted to do. So last year I was so happy to have the chance to be here. And now once again, because we all get close to each other, we become friends, so we want to see each other again and again. I'm an international rider. Uh, I do mountain bike as well as road uh, races. Road races as well? Yes. Uh, Mm. This year I didn't do track races. When I do it, I just do it for pre-season, like uh, to get prepared for the season. It's not something competitive. Um, but the last two seasons, most of all, I did marathons. Although before that, I used to do XCO, and that's what I like the most. It's XCO uh, races. Um, this this season, I decided to go to the World uh, Championship on marathon. It's done and I'm back to XCO. <laughs> That's it. Oh, 40 something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was a huge experience. It was a huge, huge Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really had that goal. I wanted to be there. And okay, it's done. Well, as you train every day because you have to worry about what you eat, you have to worry about how you sleep, when you sleep. Uh, so it depends. Sometimes um, there is not uh, a certain time to, well, I can say today is two hours. It depends. Sometimes you work out three hours, sometimes you work out four, sometimes you work out one, one and a half. It depends on the goal, on the moment of the season. And that's it. Then you also have to think about your recovery, attending the physio, that is very important. Any injury you may have, any medical problem, and every, if you have a, a disease or something, well, you have to re rethink all your workout planning. It's, it's interesting. It's not so complicated as it might look like. You get used to it. It's like going to school. You know that you have to catch the bus, you have to go to the classroom. So it's just the same. You get used to it. It's part of our life. Yes, it is. Everybody's riding bike right now. I can tell you that every weekend there is an event going on, more than one event. So sometimes people, they don't even know, do I go there or do I go there? Because lots of things are happening on the bike. And it's not only challenge, it's not only about races, it's also about the environment, about mobility. You can go to work on your bike and the government is doing a lot about this, the green movement, so leave your car at house and go by bike. So everybody's riding bike right now. Well, I don't know about the other riders, but for me it's, it's really hard. It's not only, it's not the body, because the body gets, as I told you, you get used to this, but it's your mind, it's too many hours on the bike, uh, you have to be very disciplined, you know, so sometimes you get bored, you want to have a normal life, you want to just chill out and enjoy the landscape, but in the end you, oh no, no, I have to ride a little faster, <laughs> so it's a challenge, everything is a challenge. So, no. It's, as a matter of fact, it's a, a simple bike. I'm riding a Quare um, CXR. Uh, it's a, a frame from 2014. Um, so it's a hard tail. I don't even bring a full suspension. But for the other riders, for the riders that are coming next year, uh, I would suggest them to bring a full suspension because Himalayas is a really hard race. You have rocky a lot, so you will need one. Uh, have good wheels, like jack wheels, and they are made in Portugal. So, and and I have a, a good uh, a fork uh, from an engineer, a Portuguese engineer, and the tune it. So, it's not a, my bike is a good bike, <laughs> but okay, I think that most of the riders that are here have awesome bikes because 
you and the bike you become one so it's just not you don't you are in shape but your bike must be in shape as well <laughs> My favorite place to ride. I love Himalayas. I, I really do. I, lo I love India. Okay, but one thing is India and the people and the food. Another thing is the race. Uh, maybe Philippines. Uh, yeah, I love the being there. Yes, um, it was a nice place. It's it's hot. It's there is a lot of humidity, but I like the tracks a lot. But I <laughs> don't. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I enjoy riding. You can take me anywhere. I will say that I like it. I just like riding. Thank you so much no. for talking to us. Namaste. Namaste.